Hello everyone, my name is Brian Johnny and I am from Miami, Florida. This month, June, is known as the month of the Sacred Heart of Jesus. The Sacred Heart of Jesus is a symbol of God's boundless love for all of mankind. The Sacred Heart of Jesus, burning with the love of light, like fire, is a symbol of divinity. Today, I'll be showing you guys a tutorial on how to paint the Sacred Heart of Jesus. You will be painting this with me. Now, I used a canvas. The materials are a canvas board. You can use any size, whatever size you would like. Paint. I used the Royal and Lane Nickel Company. So the paint colors I used were Cadmium Red, Mars Black, Primary Yellow, Titanium White, and I also used three small tubes of paint from the company called Dealer and Rowney. And the colors are Raw Umber and Yellow Ochre. For paint brushes, I used three main brushes. I used a very simple, small, thin brush for the smallest details. I used a medium sized brush for all the big parts and I used a round brush for blending. Let's get started. Okay guys, the first thing you wanna do is on a paper plate, have three drops of red paint. On the first drop of red paint, add white to make the red lighter. To the third drop of red paint, add black to make the red darker. To the last drop of red paint, leave it alone. Starting with the lightest color, place the color to the left side of the heart, top left. And then from there, gradually add the darker shades to create a light ombre, focusing on the left side of the heart being lightest to darkest, which is on the right side of the heart. An easy tip for blending is to use water. Dampen the brush with water, but not too much water, and blend the two colors Remember, when adding black paint or the darkest shades of red, you only want to add a little bit of the paint to the brush because the black, which is a dark color, can easily overpower the light colors. So, adding a little bit amount of black is the easiest and surest way to go.
The first thing you want to do is using the tiniest brush, apply a small hint of light brown onto the brush and then lightly draw the thorns using the paint on top of the heart. You want to use the light shade so that after, if you want, you can apply darker shades to create depth to the thorns. Using the image, just reference the image to do the basic layout of the thorns using the lightest shade of brown you have. Also paint the thorns not just inside but also outside the heart to give the look as if the thorns are wrapped around the heart. Now from here, you can either leave it like it is, just the basic light brown, or what I'm doing, this is optional, is using two shades, a darker brown and a light yellow brownish color, yellow ochre, I'm applying shades to the thorns to give the thorns a real life 3D look. By adding these shades, it will give the thorns a look as if it's actually piercing the heart. For the four blood droplets, we will be using the red in which we used for the heart. Using the red, use a thin brush and draw the four blood droplets using the red paint. After, apply a small hint of white on top of the four red droplets and blend the white outward to make the light spots of the blood light. After, add a black outline to the right side of each four of the blood droplets to cast a shadow onto the heart. For the fire flames, first outline the flames red and orange. Then, in the middle of the flames, add yellow. Blend those three colors to create an ombre effect to create the flames. For the cross above the flames, using a thin brush, apply black paint on the cross. Make sure you leave a gap of white between the bottom of the cross and the flames. Using orange and yellow paint, apply them beneath the cross. This gives the illusion that the flames are around the cross. Using a thin brush, apply some yellow paint to the sides of the black cross. This gives the idea that the light from the flames are on the sides of the cross. Once you guys finish painting the flames in the cross, you can stop right here and your sacred heart painting is complete. But for my canvas, since my canvas was white, I thought the background was very empty. So I decided to paint yellow rays around the Sacred Heart. 
I also decided to add the rays of light around the heart because in John chapter 8 verses 12, Jesus declares that he is the light of the world. Light is a symbol of divinity and Jesus is the light of the world. Christ is the one who enlightens us and reveals to us God. The sacred heart shows and reveals the depths of God's love for us. A tip for painting rays is to make sure that each ray is at its own length. Don't make all the rays the same length. If you paint each ray a different length, this gives the illusion that the heart is truly shining. Now repeat this step onto the other side of the heart. The last and final thing that you can do, this is optional, is to write sacred heart of jesus i place my trust in you the top portion of my canvas looked empty so i decided to write this at the top to fill in the space for this step i used the calligraphy tombow brush pen but you guys can also use paint <laughs> 